there is a long correlation between anarchism and pedophilia and support for pedophilia. <laughs> the Oh. oh, wait, 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 wait. That's a beautiful line. Thank you so much for asking. How about something relevant? I've been talking about rape culture all day, and pedophilia and the support of pedophilia is not rape culture. Actually, actually, it seems you're acting like this is a spurious connection. So we're going to play Jeopardy. This is, we're going to play queer theory, we're going to play queer theory, pedophilia, Jeopardy. Okay, answer. Uh, commonly called the godfather of queer theory. Uh, who, is Foucault? who is Foucault? I got it. Okay, 100 points. Um, Foucault, uh, another way to ask this is who argued, no, I guess the answer would be, argued for the eradication of age of consent laws as in down to infants? Mm -hmm. Who is Foucault? <laughs> Thank you. Okay, next one. Um, uh, the author of the the author of the uh, founding document of queer theory. Who is Gail Rubin? Who is Gail Rubin? Um, what percentage? No, no. The answer is fifty percent. Question is the amount in that article that was a defense of pedophilia, specifically quote boy lovers, so men who fuck boys. Oh. And since you're not believing me, quote, quote, this is in the founding document of queer theory. Like communists and homosexuals in the 1950s, boy lovers are so stigmatized that it is difficult to find defenders of their civil liberties, let alone for their erotic orientation. That's in the founding document of queer theory. Um, oh, I'm sorry, I'm using facts. <laughs> a thousand, a thousand apologies. One must never let facts in the way. Oh, and she also compared, by the way, she compared pedophilia, she compared pedophilia to uh, a preference for spicy food. Um, the thing is, I have never heard of anyone who has to have years of therapy because they ate hot and sour soup. Okay, so up to 200. Now it is, uh, now it is, now it is pedophilia and queer theory for 300. Uh, that would be author of uh, Macho Sluts. My author of Macho Sluts and Public Sex. Pat Califia. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. What was it somebody said? Stay relevant. Okay, let's talk. Let's talk about uh, Pat Califia. Okay, here's something from one of uh, Pat Philippia's books. You know, it's really interesting. It's really interesting that when I actually start talking about the relationship between queer theory and anarchism and pedophilia, that uh, it becomes, they, they really want to shut me up now. Um, okay, so here's Pat Philippia. Pat Philippia. Oh, wait, 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 just a second. Just a second. I was accused of homophobia because I am against pedophilia. Yes. Right. Who is it who actually makes the connections between that? Okay, here's something by Pat Califia. Pat Califia has written, any child old enough to decide whether or not she or he wants to eat spinach, play with trucks, or wear shoes is old enough to decide whether or not she wants to run around naked in the sun, masturbate, sit in someone's lap, or engage in sexual activity, by which she does not mean play doctor, she means with adults. She's very clear about that because she also says that uh, pedophiles should be more and not less uh, invested in children's lives. Mm. Okay, so we're at 300. 400 is uh, the most famous uh, queer theorist of today. Answer. Judith. Judith. No, it is not Judith Butler. Oh. Who is Ju Judith oh. Butler? <laughs> Okay, Judith Butler is the most uh, famous queer theorist of the day. We see you, all of you supporters yeah. here, who Good. do not care about trans people's lives. Every person here supports trans people's lives. We support every gender role that you don't Okay, okay, okay. Here's a great quote from Judith Butler. Here's a great quote from Judith Butler. That's not a large, that's a bumper. That is the fucking truth. 
Okay, so, so Judith Butler wrote, so I keep adding this qualification. When incest is a, so I keep adding this qualification. When incest is a violation, suggesting I think there may be occasions in which it's not. Why would I talk that way? Well, I do think that there are probably forms of incest that are not necessarily traumatic, and which, or which gain their traumatic character by virtue of the conscience of social stain that they produce. Yeah, that's true. But that's one of that's one of the queer heroes. Okay, now now we have we have uh, uh, for 500 uh, we have um, the last one in the queer theory and pedophilia. Uh, the answer is queer theorist who has spoken out strongly against pedophilia. Zero. Zero. Who is no one? Who is no one? Not a single one. Because the entire thing is based on transgressing. Yeah, I know, dear fucking God. <laughs>